Today I'm meeting up with cellist Sue Ali and we're going to play a version of Largo's Fairy Dance that was written by Nathaniel Gow in 1802. Oh, and we're recording it at the Celtic Connections Festival, the only place in the world to be in January. Largo's Fairy Dance is two tunes. The first one is a slow march, it's called The Fairies Advancing, and the second one is the well-known fairy dance reel. Nathaniel Gow dedicated this reel to the Fife Hunt, an organisation he used to play at their balls. I looked up the Fife Hunt as well, a really interesting organisation. They were started in 1786 by a guy called Alex Scrivager from Burke Hill. The organisation operated over a vast amount of countryside from Forfar to Perth to Clackmannan. It was quite amazing and they were reputed to have an excellent pack of foxhounds with almost an unequal degree of excellence and were unrivaled in Scotland for their steadiness, strength and speed. We have a lot to thank Nathaniel Gow for. He did so much publishing, including all of his dad's Neil Gow's music. And I think without Nathaniel Gow, our tradition would not be what it is today. Now, if you'd like to hear more of Nathaniel's music, Concerto Caledonia recorded an album called Nathaniel Gow's Dance Band, and you can hear it on Spotify. And if you'd like to have a go at playing any of these tunes, you can download the music in the link below. One, two, Three. <laughs> Thank you. 
you enjoyed this content, why don't you consider supporting my Patreon account, which is www.patreon.com forward slash Simon Tubier. You can also subscribe to me on Facebook and YouTube, and that'd be much appreciated. See you later.